Thank you for joining me today. The focus of this meditation is going to be activation of our Earth Star Chakra. This Earth Star is about 12 inches beneath your feet. Ideally, going outside for this activation will truly bring the healing that you need but it can be done anywhere. So we're gonna do this through a series of mudras, and that's hand positions that activate the flow of energy throughout our body and throughout the universe. When we are grounded to that earth star, we are truly healing ourselves, clearing ourselves and clearing the universe. So it's so important that we all connect to the earth's crest and send that healing love to it. Okay, so the first mudra that we're gonna go to is our fearlessness. And that is, just like the picture shows, holding your hand flat, straight, fingers together, and thumb together. Resting those hands in your lap and just visualizing a bright ruby red light swirling at that root chakra, knowing we can go forward safely, courageously, and without pause in everything we do. Now breathe deeply and say these words to yourself my courage and self-assurance is unwavering and we'll say it again my courage and self-assurance is unwavering let that red light bathe over you my courage and self-assurance is unwavering. We're going to connect up to that third eye chakra right in the middle of your forehead with a beautiful indigo color. We're going to take our, just like the picture shows, our index finger and the tip of our thumb, join them together in a beautiful circle with those last three fingers still laid out flat. Again, put those hands in your lap. Breathe deeply into this color. This will help us access our wisdom. focus here is to awaken the divine wisdom of the universe. Accept it, let it flow through you. I awaken to the divine wisdom of the universe. I awaken to the divine wisdom of the universe. Now we're going to refocus that attention to the beautiful orange from the sacral chakra. Spending extra time visualizing that beautiful bright orange radiating from just above our pelvis. Trusting that all pathways are clear and everything is opening. We're going to interlace our bottom three fingers, just like the picture shows, touching our finger pads together on our index finger and our thumb pads together, stretching wide, breathing through this mudra. Not only are we 
open to the divine wisdom of our third eye. We're open to the divine feminine within us. So this is going to activate those inner cycles, the fluidity that is within all of us. And that we need to flow from one chakra to the other. I am open to the divine fem feminine within me. We'll say it three times. I am open to the divine feminine within me. Breathing, accepting the truth that I am open to the divine feminine within me. Beautiful. This next mudra gets a little more complicated. It's our transformation one and it's, it's gonna activate that solar plexus, allowing us to transform ourselves into what we need to be to best serve our own true path. So just like the picture shows, we want to um, interlace our fingers with our right thumb over the left thumb. And then once we have a nice little um, double fist happening, we're going to extend our middle finger straight out, touching the pads, and then raise the or rest the base of your wrists on your solar plexus area as you breathe deep. Mm, transforming. Everything that doesn't serve you. to active movement, pushing you into what you need. We're going to breathe. That inner light illuminates and guides me on my path. Again, we'll say it three times. Inner light illuminates and guides me on my path. Inner light illuminates and guides me on my path. Next, we're gonna go into release. And this is one of my favorite mudras. The Kali Mudra, Goddess Kali, she is severe. She'll help us release anything that's not serving us on this path. And she'll help us align with our own truth. So interlacing those last three fingers or the bottom three fingers with your index fingers touching at the pad and right or left thumb over right thumb. But this also is going to affect anybody with a thyroid condition. So um, use this one with care and with caution. So breathing this beautiful blue from our throat chakra throughout our entire body. We're going to release all obstacles and align to our true paths. I'm going to say it again. I release all obstacles and align to my true nature. I release all obstacles and align to my true nature. One more time to make it right. I release all obstacles and align to my true nature. And what a great time to move into self-trust, releasing the judgments of everybody and following your own intuition 
we're going to trust ourselves. So just like the picture shows, you want to keep those fingers interlaced loosely with your index nail on your right hand, touching the pad of the index finger on your left hand, spreading those thumbs out and holding this right to your heart chakra. Imagining the flow of green wash over your entire body, knowing that you have your best interests at, at heart. Only you can know what the best path is for you. You can trust yourself. You can be enthusiastic with your plans, with your dreams, with your wishes. Move forward in confidence. Oh yeah, okay, so the focus for this mudra is unshakable confidence guides my journey forward, right? Yes, you're ready for your journey. It is time for you to be here for yourself and healing others through what's best for you. Unshakable confidence guides my journey forward. One more time. Unshakable confidence guides my journey forward. Whenever you start to get panicky, feel like Maybe somebody else is, knows better for you, somebody else's judgment is more right than your instinct. Somebody else's idea is better than your idea. Whenever you start to doubt yourself in those ways, interlace those fingers, place that on your heart chakra and just let the green flow through you. Know that only you know what's best for yourself and you can just trust yourself in everything you do. We're going to move on to sealing this through the spiritual truth mudra. So with your index finger and thumb creating a, an O or a closed circle. Um, you're going to want to put your hands in front of your heart and touch the tips of those fingers together. Your left palm faces inward and right palm faces outward. So this one, washing the brilliant purple light. over our entire body, honoring the wisdom the universe has given you. We're going to say this. I awaken the vision of my highest truth. Now is the time. Be truthful with yourself. Trust in yourself. Release all the judgments that aren't serving you transform yourself, be open to the possibilities, and move forward fearlessly, taking this all down into that root chakra, and allowing it to raise up, encircling you, empowering you, helping you move forward in the path that's right for you. I awaken the vision of my highest truth, breathing that in, allowing to move the energy down your spinal column into the root chakra, and then encircling your whole body with the brilliance of these words. I awaken the vision of my highest truth. Breathing deeply, basking in the love that has just been naturally given to you. They're waiting for you to accept it. Thank you so much for joining me today. <laughs>